this, this journey started a long time ago. And you want to talk about work ethic. LT Hutton and I had a meeting, I mean, I, I don't know how many years ago it was. He was like, come over to the offices and I want to tell you what I want to do, my vision. And it's going to start with this movie, All Eyes on Me. Uh, we're going to build something big and build it the right way. And he laid out a vision. I don't want to tell you the other movies that he laid out in this whole meeting, but he's got some visionary stuff. And you start to realize that the work ethic and the control over product, he was taking that same mentality from music and applying it to the film industry, which is very rare. Because in film, so many people are glad handers and they're trying, they're afraid, and they're always trying to. I got to go to this thing to meet this person so I can do this. And he was saying, I'm going to figure out a way to do it myself. And then other people are going to want to come on board with me. Um, and then as far as pot goes, you know, when I was early in my career, very early in my career, I waited tables at a place in Beverly Hills that was very popular at the time. It was, I had a shift from 11 at night to 7 in the morning called Larry Parker's. And all the hip hop. Everybody would come through there late after they got out of the studio, um, you know. And I, and I mean, there's very memorable nights. I remember one time, um, Mary J came in with KC because they were dating at the time, and they got in this big fight, and tables were full. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, Snoop would come in all the time. Pac would come in. I mean, LT would tell you. I'm sure he was there all the time. I didn't know him at the time, uh, but people would come to me, man. Do you sing? Do you sing? And you know. You there were people were trying to make deals in the in in in, in this restaurant because it was that popular at the time, but but the, the that world was just bubbling with energy, and Pac represented the to me the pinnacle of that energy. He was a firebrand. He was he he took all of it and said, "I'm going to take it to this level," and and obviously, uh, Demetrius does an amazing job getting the essence of who he 